We already at the gym. We in the parking lot. We late as hell, y'all. It's 10 o'clock. Look, <laughs> look. I didn't think that was gonna rhyme, but it ended up rhyming. Yeah, we're super late, baby. I got up at 8 30. This always happens. I get up when I'm supposed to get up, but well, let me tell y'all what happened today, child. Um, y'all know I just got my new phone, my iPhone 12. I got it uh December 23rd. And um I'm just now hooking up my Apple Watch, so that's what really took. I waited to the last minute. Literally, I'm trying to walk out the door, and I was like, "Oh my God, baby, we ain't got no Apple Watch. We cannot do our first like real legit workout of the year. Like I haven't been. This is my first time going to the gym in 2021. Where the money reside? Where the money reside? I don't even know how that went in there, but I just really wanted to say it. Um. Anyway, y'all. Yeah, this is my first gym day. 2021 january 4 um i worked out yesterday though january 3rd y'all see my work yeah, did y'all watch my workout my mr london that was officially my first workout of the year but this is my first for, for real for real for real for real y'all i don't know why i keep one oh it keep one to focus on this little fixed steering wheel but yeah this is my first for real um gym workout is she vlogging i be excited when i see people vlogging i don't think she's vlogging anyway um y'all I'm excited. So it's Monday. So that means it's leg day, y'all. I'm starting a new program. It's starting. We 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 got new stuff. Um, y'all let's see. I don't know if I'm gonna film all my workout because y'all know like I moved and it's a totally new gym, and I'm already like nervous because I ain't never felt at this gym. I gotta fill it out. I will tell y'all one thing, it ain't a lot of people that look like me at this gym, so you know I'm kind of scared, child. I don't want them to be like, what's she doing? You know, anyway. I'll figure out what I'm gonna do. But y'all, y'all wanted vlogmas because I wanted to release a guide. Um, a body recomp guide like for beginners, but y'all wanted vlogmas. I couldn't do it, y'all. But I'm gonna get it this month. So it's gonna probably be released. No, not probably. We got goals. In February. I'm gonna work on it this month. So um I, I don't know if I'm gonna put these workouts in it. So let me not lie, because these may be too too much. But it will be a guide coming in a month. So yeah. Anyway, y'all, I'm gonna do leg day. Um, I track my workouts if y'all don't know because you need to make sure you're doing progressive overload That's the only way you know you're getting stronger gaining that muscle Y'all by the title y'all know we get back on track. So we doing gym. We doing what I eat in the day y'all We're gonna talk about nutrition and what goals we got this month. Uh, what we doing? What that protein looking like all that so, um First things, not really, but y'all, I got a new Omani new pre workout. It's not, it is new. I've only taken it once, so I got it like, like my last time coming to the gym was like, I don't know, maybe a week or so before Christmas. And it's the Breeze Berry. And when I tell y'all, this has become my fave, like the pre workout flavor. Um, I, my favorite pre workout was the the Rainbow Candy, which is still really good. But this Breeze Berry is, mm, and. I have my BCA is the gummy worm, but I don't know why I keep acting like the BCA of choice isn't the sour peach ring. Oh, no, I didn't do that. They didn't have the sour peach ring last time because I was like, why didn't you get sour peach ring? Because I know I love my dang on sour peach ring. They ain't have sour peach ring. So anyway, y'all, I'm not going to bore y'all in this car taking pre-workout. I'll see you guys in the gym. Yeah, talking to my mirror like I love you so much. Curving all my critics like I heard you so what? You can't kill my confidence, I think I'm the man. Tally all the f I ever gave on my head. Lately, I've been living like I can't take a loss. They ain't wanna help me, that's what made me a boss. You can't kill my confidence, I think I'm the man. We don't give a f that's what they don't understand. I'm back again like two season. I broke records while loose leaf and I'm coming now on my roof leaving. Don't give a f I don't care. Uh did the f but my lonesome. No wonder now I'm on one. No shortcuts on that long run. All I really want is my share. Uh get on my god on my told him it's nothing. In the discussion, f all them feelings I throw all my pain on percussion. The disgusting. I hear I'm bragging about that they did and it do not move me, not in the least. They ain't been dropping no seeds in the soil, but swear that you all my spot at the feast. I've been on go mode, show mode, show. Robo, robo, wave ride, cool shawty, too naughty, pool party, wet for the face ride. Any up, penny down, hand me down, thrift store, old drip, new money, too funny, old shorty, talk about old. I'm on they now, can't get a pass now, I'm a cash cow, keeping it brash now, it's trash now, I'm a spaz out, I've been killing my lows and living on highs, you see in the skies the proof, you could just see in my eyes that there is no lies, I cannot disguise the truth. Hey y'all, we's back from the 
gym. Okay, so it's time to eat, y'all. I'm not about to play with my appetite. It's 141. Yo, I'm not trying to do this in 2021. I'm really not, but I'm not hungry. I was going to make a protein shake, and I feel like I should have just did that. Um, at the gym, I pretty much got my entire workout with, like, the exception of, like, maybe two or three exercises. Um, I really wanted to do cardio, but I just didn't have the time because I have some sponsored content to do today. I got bash fit orders that have to be dropped off, y'all. So I was just like, girl, you gotta go because, like, okay, it's 2 o'clock. So I have made breakfast. I'm about to show y'all. Y'all, these salmon burgers that I had in my last grocery haul, they not it. Like, they not gross, but I don't like them. So I made this yesterday, but I had uh, potatoes. If you follow me on Instagram, then you sent it, okay? But anyway, so this is it's just on a napkin. <laughs> Y'all, because, like, I'm really trying to hurry up and eat, put my face on, do what I got to do. So, it's on a Hawaiian bun. It's the salmon patty. It's a slice of Munster cheese, two fried eggs, and then I got a little bit of mayo on the top patty, y'all. I didn't do the mayo yesterday. Um, I just don't, I don't think I like the way these are seasoned. I think that's what it is. I don't know. I was not feeling it. Um, I need to track. So we're going to talk about our nutrition stuff that we're doing. So for the month of January, y'all, I'm more focused on protein, on a high protein diet because I'm not going to lie. I've been playing with protein for the longest. Like I always say, y'all, protein, protein, protein. I be telling y'all, but I don't even follow my own advice. Like that's the only reason why I'm eating this salmon patty is because it's what, 23 grams? It's, oh, I lied. It's only 16 grams of protein. That's the tilapia that's 23. Ugh, I don't know, but I got them two eggs on there, y'all. I know I'm going to have a protein shake today because I'm just going to make myself have it. Um, my appetite, which really be messing me up, but I don't care. We're going to get our protein in. That's what protein shakes are for. So you don't need protein shakes, but if you're like me and you don't be getting your protein in, that's why you have protein shakes to supplement. So I'm for real. We really, I'm really on my protein. I'm really on my protein. <laughs> That's the focus for this month. We have goals, okay? Um, y'all, I am 233 pounds. I weighed myself today. The last time I weighed myself was like the middle of December, and I was 235. So whoop whoop, lost a little bit. Y'all, I'm trying to get out the 30 so bad. I don't really have a weight loss goal. The most I would say I would want to lose though would be like 15 pounds. So let's say like be around 220-ish. Um, cause I like to be thick, child. But I don't know. We'll see. But most of most importantly is protein, cause that's what builds you the muscle that I'm trying to build is gonna be the protein. So my goals for this month is getting in 150 grams of protein. I know that's not gonna happen every day, most of the time. No. I don't aim to, for that to be an everyday thing because we're human and stuff happens. But nine times out of 10. So if it's seven days out of the week, five, six days, <laughs> we need to be trying to get 150 grams of protein in. And y'all, that's going to be hard. I'm not going to lie to y'all. I'll be happy with 120 this month and, our, and move our way up. So for me to do that, I'm going to have to track. So I'm going to go back to my, um, my app that I was using before Oh crap, y'all. I don't have it on this phone. I forgot. Y'all know I got a new phone. It was Lose It though. So let me download the Lose It app and I'll come back and show you guys and what all this was. If I can't, oh, I can't find my app. Okay, yeah. So I'm going to get the Lose It app and I'm going to track. I'm going to track this month really just for protein, but along with protein, I mean, it's going to show calories. This is the thing. So, like I just told y'all, I lost two pounds um, in December. Not even trying to eat however I want to eat, doing whatever. Um, of course, you could lose more when you trying and you're focused. But for me to have lost any, baby, when I've been living my life, I don't, I'm not, I'm going to say I don't need to worry about calories. But I'm not really focused on calories because I have a hard time eating. Especially because I don't have no recreational activity, y'all. I want to get some more. But I said, I'm going to hold off. But that's really what be messing me up. Because, see, I don't want to eat all day. But as soon as I engage in recreational activity, whoo, boy, I be eating everything. It be bad. It be hot chips, candy, cakes, whatever, right? So, really, what's been helping me, probably with them two little pounds that came off, is because I haven't had none in, like, a week. So, um... But even if I get some, I, I have to just discipline myself and say, you got to eat before you engage and we don't eat nothing else. Okay. But, um, I don't really have an issue with overeating. I don't feel like, so, I mean, calories are going to be 
track anyway because it's going to be in lose it but i'm mostly focused on protein but i'm saying long as i'm around long as i'm under like 1900 then i should be good i don't see why i would be above that again because i'd be struggling to eat but let me go ahead and eat this sandwich y'all i do not like it i don't want it y'all hold on maybe the mayo will help it like it's not gross but I, it's the way it's seasoned. Y'all see it? I'm just finna eat it and drink water. Make myself. After I'm done eating it, I'm gonna track everything and then show you guys. Y'all, I'm so full. Look, this is all that I have left. And I'm finna eat it because I want my protein. Like, I take the piece of bread off, but I want my protein. Also, I just talked mess about this, y'all. And it really wasn't that bad. I think, I'm, I think I didn't leave it in the air fryer long enough yesterday. So, it's not that bad. But I noticed it has some crunchy pieces on it today. And I was like, ooh, I like that. So, um, I think when I make it again, I'm actually paying for it. Because that's actually what the instructions say to do. So, anyway, y'all. Look at this protein, though, baby. <sighs> y'all see that? 42 grams. That's what I'm talking about. I want 30 grams and up for every meal that I eat. So, the salmon patty was 16 grams. The Hawaiian bun had 8 grams. Uh, the Havarti cheese had, oh, I thought it was mustard, but it's Havarti, 5 grams. And I had two eggs that was 13 grams. So, I made 42 grams for breakfast, y'all. And the calories for this was 593. Um, I'm going to keep it a buck with y'all. Y'all already know me. Um, I did not, I put some, I did cook my eggs in a little bit of butter. Okay. Um, and what else? Oh, I didn't track that mayo either because I don't know how much I use, but it was a squirt girl by. So anyway, I don't even want this, y'all. Let me go ahead and eat it. I don't have an appetite, y'all. Mmm. Girl, did it together. Okay. It's gone. Y'all, I forgot I took a piece of this egg off. I'm missing some protein. Oh my god. Is that serious? <laughs> Bro, my appetite is shot. I just can't eat, y'all. I'ma need to give me some recreational activity because baby, we got shit to do. We got goals to meet. Hey, y'all. So, um, I went to Whole Foods, y'all, cause it's like one down the street from my house. Cause if y'all remember the last, um, the last grocery haul, I didn't have any veggies. So I was like, I'm not gonna get none. Cause I was going back and forth to Tennessee and I was like, I want my veggies to go back. Y'all, after this trip to Whole Foods, like, I've been to Whole Foods before. Um, and I've always liked Whole Foods, but it's high. Um, it I, when I first started going to Whole Foods, it was just to say I went and I realized I couldn't keep up with it. And then definitely, like, feeding two people, I would not recommend. But by yourself, it was lit, lit. So, y'all know. Trader Joe's who? Because Whole Foods, baby, it was lit. So, I hate to tell y'all, I spent $39. But look, hold on. <laughs> Y'all be like, what? Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. All I got is veggies, really. So I got a bag of arugula because for my uh, salmon patties, I wanted when I was eating it, I was like, dang, I wish I had some. I don't really care for like lettuce on my burgers or whatever. So I like arugula. So I got a bag of arugula, 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 arugula. I got a bag of arugula. Most of these veggies is high cause, cause me, y'all know. If you know, you know. Y'all know how I am with my veggies. I got this big old thing of diced onions. Because y'all know I don't want to cut nothing. So, that's, that be my fault. I got this thing of pico. See, y'all, this is crazy. This is crazy. This pico is $6. Look at it. When you can get this same amount of pico, or you can get a bigger one at Kroger for cheaper. This is crazy. But I promise y'all, this is the freshest pico you ever had in your life. I was going to make fish tacos tonight. But then something happened at uh, Whole Foods. I'm going to show y'all. But, okay, I don't know. I'm gonna still have my fish tacos. I wanted y'all to see them. Cause I gotta eat this pico cause it ain't gonna last. Um, but yeah, I got some oat milk. Uh, I have a thing of oat milk in there y'all, but it's the vanilla kind. And plus it's been there for a while. So it's kind of old. I haven't even opened this. This is what I mean about wasting stuff. But let me, let me check the dates. Cause girl, this thing ain't even open. Oh, but just like I knew, actually no, it's January. It says best if used by January 28th. And it's not, look y'all, not even open. But the reason I got this is because the vanilla, like I have oat milk really just for my um, protein shakes because I don't eat cereal no more just because like I don't even want it, it's too sweet. <laughs> it's too sweet, who am I? Yeah, so I, I got it for my cereal but I don't eat cereal so then I use it for protein shakes because I don't really 
do anything else with milk. Um, I'm not dairy free because I love cheese, but I hate milk. I think milk is disgusting, but I like cheese and yogurt, whatever. So anyway, that's why I got this oat milk that's regular. And I'm trying to understand why this is 110 calories for a cup and this is 120 and this is the vanilla one. But whatever. So I bought a whole new oat milk. I be wasting stuff. I'm not going to throw this out. Even though it's probably gonna get thrown out anyway. Cause I really love the Chobani, but we're gonna try this oh 365 oh This stuff is high. I would not recommend. I really just went for veggies, but got this cause I was there. I was gonna get some raisin bread too, and I was like, no ma'am, cause we already doing too much. Y'all already know my boo thing, my boo thing. How about these are whole Brussels sprouts? Y'all know I like to get mine chopped, but Trader Joe's and Hannah, not Trader Joe's. Uh, Whole Foods didn't have nothing chopped, and then I was like, I just need to chop my own and stop being trifling because they fresh. Like, the ones that are Kroger, they be chopped already, be dry, and that's why I haven't been liking them. And then, y'all, I got these things of um, asparagus. This was $4.58, so that wasn't that bad. I can't believe this pico was $6. But see, y'all really see, I just got veggies. So, I got these only because y'all, I've never seen this. Oh my god, so these say large smoked oysters. I've never seen that. Trader Joe's has the best oysters. And they um actually Whole Foods had the same brand that Trader Joe's had, but then they had this and they had large and medium and then they had small. And I was like, large? So I got it, y'all. And it's 20 grams of protein. So yeah, I was like, okay, let me try this. I may be getting my oysters from there. And then I got this cliff bar, which don't I know I be telling y'all I'm not doing no more protein bars. Technically. The Cliff Bar ain't a protein bar. Cliff Bars are really good. Um, and the reason I say it's not a protein bar is because I don't feel like it's enough protein to call it a protein bar. And they high as heck in calories. But of course, because they good. So this is only 10 grams of protein. But guess how much the calories is? 260, almost 300 calories. So that's why like, I wouldn't call this a protein bar and that's why they're good. That's why they're good. I have some Cliff Bars in there, but I've never seen this flavor. It's sweet and salty peanut butter and honey with sea salt. That just sounded like a good time. So, okay. Y'all, so I don't know y'all like, how is this $40? So, in this bag is the reason we may not have fish tacos. And this was $7 alone. And I couldn't pass it up. Y'all, freaking Whole Foods. Uh-uh, hold on. Because y'all got to see this. I'm about to, I'm about to bend y'all down. Y'all got to see this. Y'all know how Whole Foods has the hot bar, right? Child, let me get up in here. Let me get up in here, y'all. Y'all. Whole Foods had roasted Brussels sprouts with bacon, and I guess this is prime rib. I just got a little bit of that, but I spent $7 for this plate. Look at this. Look at this. I'm about to taste these Brussels sprouts. They better be everything. And the whole, oh my God, they're so good. Actually, I lied. They, they all right. <laughs> they're not as good as I thought they were gonna be, but um, I'm gonna eat this. So I doubt I have a, um, They are good. I'm gonna add a little salt. Y'all know they don't be seasoning food. Um, I'm gonna add a little salt. Y'all, I love the fact that it's a whole food down the street because see, if I ever just want, like, I don't want to eat bad, but I don't want to cook, I'm gonna hit that hot bar up and give me some meat and some veggies. They got all kinds of stuff. They got salads. They got salmon that's cooked already. Child, I'm not about to play with y'all. Y'all thought we're playing this year. Who's the one we not playing? So. The reason I may not have the fish tacos is because um, I'm finna eat that, even though that's mostly just Brussels sprouts and prime rib. And see, this is why I've been messing up. First of all, I'm gonna have me a protein shake too. So see, I don't see fish tacos because I'm not even really hungry, but we'll see. I'm gonna still take a piece of fish out if I just have one and like say it's on the Brussels sprouts. Yeah, that's probably what I do. Um, I don't know that I think that's prime rib, but like the little, you know how they had the labels at the hot bar? Above it, it said buffalo chicken. I know it's not buffalo chicken. So I don't even know what it is. And then I'm not finna weigh it. See, this is why we've been messing up tracking. I didn't, this was unplanned, I'm sorry. So I think this is prime rib though, y'all. And it's just a little bit. It really is just a little bit. I'm pretty sure it's prime rib. And it's cold. So I need to warm it up. Mmm, Brussels sprouts. I'm probably about to eat all in Brussels sprouts. I ain't gonna lie to y'all. I love Brussels sprouts. I want to fill this thing up with Brussels sprouts. But I know they're charging, by the way. <laughs> so, 
So let me eat this, y'all. Put these groceries up. If I have fish tacos, I'll come back. If not, we'll make our protein shake together. And yeah, at least we're eating healthy, though. What's up? So look, y'all, I decided to be good and go ahead and weigh my um, prime rib. Since I don't really know, I'm pretty sure this is prime rib, y'all. But anyway, I have my um, scale on and it's zeroed out because I don't measure veggies, whatever. Um, and I'm just going to add this meat. It ain't nothing. Look at it. Nothing. I didn't get nothing. It is not even, it say 1.8 ounces. I'm going to just go ahead and put that it's 2 ounces. And it's 87 calories, little nothing, 12 grams of protein. But I wanted my protein really to show up. So, y'all, we had 54 grams. How we gonna eat 100 grams of protein with no appetite? How? <laughs> this is what I'm talking about, y'all. If I at least get to 100 today, that's 50 more grams, which I'm gonna finesse. I'm gonna really, really try. I'll be happy because, y'all, first of all, I said I was gonna start planning out my meal so we won't have this problem. But I'm not even hungry like that. Child, it's, I told y'all it was hard. It's a struggle. Okay, y'all, I am so excited to cook this dinner because y'all know I like super quick and it's about to be super quick. We about to get it in. So I have some Brussels sprouts left, praise the Lord. Um, they made it. And I'm just about to cook that piece of tilapia. I took out a piece of tilapia and make a fish taco. And I'm going to have a protein shake. Y'all, I did eat a little bit, okay? I had a Cliff Bar. I was telling you guys I had a, some Cliff Bars. This is the uh, crunchy peanut butter. This one actually has 11 grams of protein. I don't know why the other one only got 10. It's pretty good. I don't know if y'all tried these. They good. They high as heck in calories, but for me, I needed it. I still ain't ate a thousand calories, y'all, but I mean, I'm pretty sure I have because I'm at 960 and I didn't count the butter. I didn't count the mayo and I haven't count no veggies like Brussels sprouts. So I'm going to write around about a thousand calories, but I'm saying I'm supposed to be having a thousand more. <laughs> so, um, yeah, I had one of these and I did log it in my uh, Lose It app, but y'all, we about to go ahead and cook. I'm about to toss these Brussels sprouts in the air fryer for a second because I just, just to warm up so they won't get soft and cook this tilapia. Let's get it. We ain't cooked a lot in here yet. So I'm still getting used to the gas. Um, I noticed that I didn't put my little things, the little black things back on when I was cleaning the stove. I didn't put them on right. And you can definitely tell because that fire get to acting stupid. Um, that one's on right. So I'm finna just spray my pan down with olive oil for the fish. And I love these pans because don't nothing stick to them. Like, I promise y'all, they are great. I'm gonna keep them in perfect condition by using plastic, okay? So I'm gonna turn my little eye on. Where we at? Just the right one? Yep. I'm gonna just put it on medium, let it heat up real quick, and then I'll uh, toss the fish in there and season it up. All right, y'all, it don't take but a second for the skillet to get hot with gas. Like, I gotta turn down a little bit. Like, it get hot right away. So I'm just gonna press my piece of tilapia in the skillet. And, oh, I didn't have it open. I'm gonna put some taco seasoning on it. That's gonna be like the main seasoning to give it, you know, like the taco taste, I guess. And I'm gonna spray it again with some more olive oil. And just put a little bit of Tony Sessions, just a little bit. Was that more than a little bit? I don't care. But yeah, also I'm gonna turn the um, eye on in the middle. And I'm gonna put that on medium and get some butter and put our tortilla on here to warm it up. I love this little thing in the middle, y'all. It's really, really cool. <laughs> so we're just gonna let that melt. We're gonna put a tortilla on it. I'm about to flip this fish over. It don't take long. Oh, well, it don't matter actually if the fish fall apart because we're gonna chop it up anyway. But I flipped it. Tilapia don't take long. Put some more taco seasoning on it. We got our little butter halfway melted here. So I'm gonna take a tortilla, y'all. If y'all looked at the um, 
the last grocery haul, y'all know I got the Mission Low Carb, the Balance Tortillas. Not because I'm low carb or anything, but because they're 70 calories. Um, so, because usually, like, if I wasn't eating all day, I planned on having two tacos, but I'm really not hungry. And I'm having a protein shake, too, so. All right, so with our fish, I'm going to go ahead and chop it because it's been cooked on both sides. Not like nothing crazy, but we're going to put it in the tortillas, so it needed to be chopped up. And then that way we can see and check if it's cooked. It's still some pieces that's kind of gray. So. All right, y'all. So I have tasted this tilapia. It is so good. So anyway, I don't know why my camera looks purple or whatever red, but I have my weigher here because I'm going to weigh. Um, no, I'm not because this is only 35 calories a tablespoon. And I'm going to weigh my sour cream, I guess. <laughs> I don't need to weigh none of this because I'm not going to put that much on there. But, <laughs> okay. I'll weigh my sour cream, but I'm not going to put nothing on there. So, let me go ahead and use my little scale. I can't believe I'm weighing freaking sour cream. This is so lame. Um, Y'all definitely don't have to do this. I need to change it to grams. Because that's what's on the bottle for the serving side. Oh, why I keep pushing tear? I need to push unit. I'm tripping, y'all. I was about to get me some wine. And I was like, oh, girl, you got to have a protein shake. And I was like, boo. <laughs> you just would have had it earlier. All right, so 30 grams of sour cream is 60 calories. I may not even use 30 grams. That's 5 grams. See? Okay, see? 15 grams. This is what I'm talking about. Girl, goodbye. 15 grams, please. So that is, uh, yeah, girl. I don't even know why I did that to myself. So I'm not going to measure nothing else and waste my time. I have that sour cream and it's slick a lot because I'm finna put a lot of stuff on this taco. Uh, so I'm about to put this uh, Ortega uh, taco ranch on here too. And this is 35 calories for a tablespoon, but yeah not a lot y'all so yeah like right y'all y'all i don't even know if y'all seen that not a lot i like to taste my taco really what i want is this pico and see this pico is vegetables keep playing with me <laughs> oh y'all this pico smells so good and fresh like this is what I want. I don't even know why I got this salsa out. We not doing no salsa today. We finna do, ooh, look at me, y'all. Put all this damn pico on there. Boom, 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 boom. Bow, 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 bow. Okay, let me stop playing with y'all. That's really, that's it. I, I, I pulled out my salsa, but I'm not finna use that. So let me put it back. This, ooh, I know this pico gonna be good because it just smells so good so i'm gonna get my brussels sprouts out the air fryer and then we're gonna make this protein shake i'm trying to figure out why this camera is so red uh, i don't know i don't like that y'all this is red it's not red in here it's white but um i'm not gonna mess with it because yeah i'm trying to eat so anyway uh y'all know if you know you know when i do my protein shake and then it like be correcting itself looks like okay when i do my protein shakes i always do ice so I'm using the Lani New Protein in Fruity Cereal. The only protein powder I drink powder is a Lani New as of yet. And if I'm drinking some other protein, it's a uh, Premier Protein. But if it's powder and I made it, a Lani on deck, okay? So, oh, I have to put one of my little shaker things in there. I be forgetting. Put one little shaker ball in there so it'll be smooth. Y'all, this oat milk is going to kill me. Let me, we got to measure this because it's 120 calories. Do not play. It's 120 calories. Um, It is eight fluid ounces. Get, let me get, get y'all a wear for real. I'm going to link a wear. <laughs> uh, not a, a scale. Okay, I said a wear. Let's do unit fluid ounces because this you don't want to play with stuff like this because this at yeah you don't want to play with that we don't want to have too much of this now eight fluid let me just see what it look like because i'm only going to have one scoop of protein 
So let me pour eight fluid first, like a serving, and see. I think we're gonna be good with eight. Oops, I did a little bit more than eight. So we are at 8.5, which is fine. Just a little bit more than a serving. Let me put it in my Lose It app. Y'all, like I said, today, if I just get to um, 100 calories or over 100, like, I'll be happy because we always mess up like this. But um, I got to, like, basically, like, uh, schedule this out because it's going to be real hard to meet these protein goals that like this unless I just schedule, like, I'm eating this, I'm eating this, I'm eating this. Hungry or not, you got to eat it type deal, which sucks because I hate making myself eat. But whatever. I done had this protein for a while, y'all. I had to check it. Does protein get old? It don't smell weird or nothing, but I have had this for a while. It, you know what? It doesn't have... It, ooh, y'all, it does have an expiration date. Oh my God, I know it's probably expired too. No, actually protein lasts for a long time. This says 5 2021 and I've had this for a while. So we good, we good, uh, but yeah, we good till May. I shouldn't even have it this long, but see, I don't be doing what I'm supposed to have. I, if I would just eat, drink my protein like I'm supposed to, we wouldn't have this. And I got two other things. I have a lemon meringue and a munchies. Munchies is lit, should have had munchies. But um, yeah, so. That's it for the uh, protein drink. Let's see. I didn't add it to lose it. So let me add my Laninu. We're going to scan it. I just had one scoop. So, y'all, we are at 1,300 calories, 1,388. So, I would say, like, with the little stuff that I didn't track, I would give me 15. I, I don't even think it's 15, but I would give me 15, and we still doing good. But let's look at this protein. Baby, hey, we did it. We did it. 119? 119 grams? I'll take that. I will take that, because 120 is damn good. That's only 20... No, that's 30 grams off. So, yeah. I'll take that. I'll take that. Well, we're going to try better. We're going to try to do better. We, you know what? See, if we just would have had one more protein shake during the day, we would have been there. So, see, that's not bad. That's not bad. <clears throat> now, the only thing is I got to eat all of this or it don't count. So, I got to drink this whole shake. Let me taste it with the new oat milk because I've always used that vanilla. So, it shouldn't be that sweet. Because, see, the reason why the vanilla oat milk was just too sweet is because Alani knew already be sweet. It's good. So, like, the oat milk with the vanilla just made it real, real sweet. See, perfect. It's sweet. It's still sweet. But that's because Alani is sweet. All right. I'm going to drink that. Let me taste this taco for y'all. I already know it's going to be great, but I just want to make sure. Just to ensure. Okay. Mmm. Mmm. Y'all, that taco is banging. Mmm. -hmm. I'm enjoying this. This is probably the best what I eat today I've had probably in a long time. And I say that because we got we get we did good for protein. For my first day, we was 120 grams. I'll take that. We did good for protein. The food was good. I ate today, y'all notice. I had breakfast. I had Brussels sprouts and a little bit of prime rib. I had a cliff bar. Oh my God, I'm eating. This was lit. I'm so happy. I'm so happy. If you still here, leave me a clapping hand emoji because baby, we did it today. We did it. Check out other videos from me here on the screen. I hope y'all are subscribed so we can see how we're going to go with this protein journey. I told you guys my goals I'm trying to do. And we're going to check back in February 1st. Thank you guys for watching. I'll see you guys in my next video.